ocean currents are continuously and direct movement of ocean water. Prevailing wind. A wind from the direction that is predominant and particular place or system. We are going to use a global map to represent prevailing winds and ocean currents. We are going to use a fan to represent a prevailing wind. This blue color represents cold water. And now the prevailing wind. The red color represents the hot water. And now the prevailing winds. The factor that causes these global circulation patterns is uneven heating. The ocean currents, the air can change their movement because of the Coriolis effect and global convergence. Belts can change their movement because of the difference in density. The circulation patterns make a rayon hotter or colder. The ocean currents also affecting the regional climate. Now I'm going to compare the climate, atmospheric and ocean circulations of Miami, Lima, Seattle, Cape Town and Western Australia. Miami and Peru, the climates are very similar because they are close to the line of equator. In Miami, the, the climate is drier and in Peru, the climate is damp. In Cape Town, South Africa, the waters are warmer like in Western Australia and in the winter are drier and cooler. Seattle is colder because it's farther from the line of equator and closest to the North Pole. Australia is closer to the equator, so its waters are warmer than Seattle's waters. Oceanic circulating has a greater impact on these locations because the ocean currents can affect the general climate of these areas. 